So to build the potato gun, you want to take your combustion chamber, the four inch pipe, put the reducer on one end, and then the end cap on the other side. Go ahead and put that one on. And then the barrel just slides right on the top. And a little tip for the barrel is go ahead and grind off the sides here so that it's really sharp and you can just jam a potato on there and it cuts it to right to the right size. You get a lot of questions about the igniter that we use and you can just get these at Home Depot or on Amazon. They're super easy. I'll show you guys how to do that. And then last to make the bonds for the PVC pipe, you wanna use primer and cement. Go ahead and get two screws that are pretty long and then you're going to want to drill them into the combustion chamber and these are going to be used for the ignition system. Go ahead and back them out just a little bit um, so that we can put the leads on. Now with the igniter, go ahead and cut off both wires um, from this piece and then strip a little bit off. And then to make the handle for the igniter to sit into, um, find a PVC pipe that fits your igniter and go ahead and melt the bottom of it and then press it onto your four inch pipe so that it makes a nice rounded edge and then notch out a little, a little bit of the bottom so that the wires can go ahead and um, be fed through there. Mine's nice and snug in there, fits pretty good. The wires will just go like this Go ahead and glue on your pipe. Gonna add some around the edge. Here's the final product I got. Um, I went ahead and duct taped the grip on and everything. It works great, you can go ahead and press it super sturdy. So there's your potato gun. Mm -hmm.